Assalamu alaikum my dear brothers and sisters I hope you all are doing fine and enjoying Ramadan inshallah I know that it's already second week of Ramadan may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala accept all our ibadahs prayers and fasting inshallah we are baking chicken fritters or you can say chicken pakore today you can enjoy this in iftar during Ramadan and you can serve it as an appetizer after Ramadan in your parties I know it's locked down we cannot do any parties but inshallah taala may allah subhanahu wa taala bring that day very soon inshallah i hope you will like it so let's just start our recipe now yeah so bismillahir rahmanir rahim this is oil for frying this is half kg boneless chicken cut into small cubes this is 1 teaspoon garam masala powder if you don't know how to make garam masala powder at home then you can find this recipe on my channel inshallah this is 1 tablespoon roasted coriander powder 2 tablespoon corn flour 2 tablespoon rice flour this is 3 tablespoon chopped cilantro this is 1 tablespoon green chilies chopped 1 teaspoon kashmiri chili powder 1 teaspoon chili flakes and 1 teaspoon salt salt and chilies are you can add it according to your own taste this is whisked one egg this is 1 tablespoon garlic paste 1 tablespoon ginger paste so let's start our recipe now so bismillahir rahmanir rahim so now we are marinating everything in the chicken we will marinate all the spices everything in the chicken except oil so bismillahir rahmanir rahim coriander powder and garam masala powder corn flour and rice flour kashmiri chili powder chili flakes and salt chopped cilantro chopped green chilies ginger garlic paste i love ginger garlic in chicken or in any meat first of all it's very healthy plus its flavor it's so good so that's why i always add so much in my cooking and now it's egg bismillah one whisked egg just mix it up bismillah this is pretty easy if you have all the ingredients so you can just mix it up marinate for example if you are just frying uh, half of this chicken today and you can save it for tomorrow's after too so for example you can easily um, keep it in fridge for three to four days inshallah as long as it is marinating so it's all done it's all mixed up so now we will cover it up and leave it in the fridge for an hour so this is how it looks like when we mixed every single thing in this except oil so then we will marinate it for an hour and then we will fry it after an hour inshallah right i already marinate uh, some chicken for you so we will fry that instead of waiting for this marination i already turned on my burner the other thing is that you will fry on low to medium flame because otherwise maybe chicken will not get tender so bismillahir rahmanir rahim so this is the already the marinated one which i already did it for you and the other one is already marinating but we didn't have time so we are frying these chicken uh, the other tip i would like to give it to you that for example if you are in a hurry and you have to make it so you just you can marinate it for 15 minutes but you can add chicken tenderizer in that around half teaspoon and leave it for 15 minutes so i hope so that it will get quick uh, and chicken will get tender inshallah so bismillahir rahmanir rahim so i already put enough oil in that for deep frying so bismillahir rahmanir rahim you cannot add oil at once because otherwise it will get sticky so just add one by one inshallah i hope you will like this recipe so don't forget to give me the feedback also As you can see we put chicken as much as we can so we are frying on a low flame otherwise i will get fried but the probability would be that the chicken won't get tender 
So we have to be patient. So after seven to eight minutes, so then we will flip its sides. So after five to 10 minutes, we will flip its sides. We are not cooking on high flame, otherwise chicken won't get tender. We are again flipping it up. So as you can see that it is frying from all sides. So increase your flame to medium to high. So as you can see, all are fried. So uh, our half work is done that these are tender. And now we are just making it crispy because we all love crispy pakore or fritters. And our all chicken fritters are fried and they are crispy on high flame. Now we will turn it off and we will dish out these chicken fritters. Bismillah. Bismillah. So dear viewers, fritters are ready. They are all fried and crispy. You can you can hear the sound, Masha. It's so crispy and looking tempting, but we cannot eat it right now. So and the other thing is that these this is chaat masala, so you can sprinkle on top of it. You will love it, inshallah. And um, bon appetite. So enjoy this during the iftar time, and please remember me in your prayers. So see you next week, inshallah. Take care and keep praying. Assalamu alaikum.